everybody. Hello. So we are so excited. We're back at Disney California Adventure and we are here for Lunar New Year 2024, one of our favorite Disney events. That is right, it is the year of the dragon and we're so excited to check out some festive food and drinks, see some new characters, see the parade and so much more. I know definitely some food is calling our name, don't oh. you think, Mom? Yeah, I'm kind of getting hungry, as usual. Of course we are. Plus, you know us, we like to shop and we definitely love to meet the characters. And we do. Maybe even get a cheeky drink, who knows? Possibly. Either way, we're getting kind of a late start, as usual, so I think we had better decide what food we're gonna get and get going. So follow us along, why don't you, to Lunar New Year at Disney California Adventure 2024. Also, there's so many changes in the world. Things oh, yes. change all the time. I am so happy both of you found your place and yeah. that you found who you are. And yes. I must say that I'm so proud of my Maymay for deciding yes. to hold on to her panda. Yes. I think more so, more important now than ever. We I must agree. be true to ourselves. We must yes. honor ourselves. Am I right? That's true, it's and mother-daughter friendship and relationship is very important. It is. It you know is. the number one rule in my family is to honor my parents. Uh, but I have to remind her she needs to honor herself before anything. First, as well. Well, it was great meeting uh, Mei Mei and Ming Li. 
They were great, another mother-daughter duo, and we love that. We love that about them. Absolutely, and we checked out the parade. We've had a pretty good start. We're ready for some food and cheeky drinks, but we couldn't help it. We figured we'd check out the merch first, because we love to shop. These are beautiful. Oh my goodness, let me take a look. Very sparkly. Those are gorgeous, I love I it. There's the back. Ooh, may have to get these, I don't know. I know. They kind of matches what you're wearing, Mom. Want to hold them? I do. Yeah, you should get them. Aren't they pretty? Gorgeous. And what do we have here? We have Mickey in his parade outfit. Oh, it's the year of the dragon. So Mickey is, he has a little dragon hat, it looks like. I know. Lovely, so you can get this Mickey dragon with these, oh, look at those dashing shoes too. No, right? Detail. Really cute. You can get those lovely ears and you can get this spirit jersey too. Year of the dragon. This is gorgeous. The uh, gold is shiny in the light. And let's look at the back. It says Year of the Dragon. Happy New Year. Wonderful. I love me a good spirit jersey. <laughs> and do you have a price for any of these, Mom? I do. On the uh, child's shirt. Oh, okay. It There's is, a child spirit jersey. Yeah, $64.99. Okay. The ears are a mystery. So the ears, I think, are about $34.95 without tax. And how much is the spirit jersey for adults? Okay, it is $84.99. Okay, you got wonderful. It. And I bet you get a magic key discount if yes. you have that. I you can get see it. it. I know. You consider it, Mom. It looks like they have red envelopes that you can give out, right, Mom? Right, for a special, um, it's a something that's done during Lunar New Year. You can put a gift or something inside, right? Money inside, Wonderful. and it's for good luck. Oh, and it's gorgeous, too, and has a dragon on the cover. Five ninety nine. Awesome. dollars 99 everybody. Okay, so we went to Longevity Noodles and got the shrimp lo mein noodles. Oh, these look delicious. It smells really good. We cannot wait to try it. Uh, we always like the noodles over there. That's always a win, I think. Plus, we're getting pretty hungry. And I ordered from Longevity Noodles the Dragon Cocktail because it is the year of the dragon after all, so I should probably get the Dragon Cocktail, I think. What do you think? <laughs> that makes 100% sense to me. Uh, I and think. I will say the lo mein noodles. It's a beautiful presentation. Oh. I was surprised. She brought it out and I went, wow. Yep, almost too pretty to eat. Well, almost. We're definitely gonna try this, so mom, why don't you go ahead and try a bite? I'm actually quite hungry. We are, but we're gonna change that in just a moment. <laughs> well, I'm gonna grab a shrimp first. I want, no, you can't though, cause I'm hungry too, but we can always get more. <laughs> Okay, Mom, so it smells delicious, it looks delicious, but is it delicious? 10 out of 10. Really? And I would go back right now and get another one. It's well, we really can make good. that happen for you, <laughs> especially if you eat all of this, because I want some. <laughs> right. So you give it a try. Lindsay, I have to tell you, you're going to die when you eat that shrimp. I bet. I love shrimp. Who doesn't love shrimp? I mean, I guess you might not, but we love shrimp here in Lindsay Land, so I'm gonna give this a go, and I think I'm gonna be pretty happy. Here we go. Mm -hmm. Right? Mm -hmm. That's exactly what I wanted today. Not too spicy, just like maybe like a very, very small hint of spice. And just the noodles and the, the shrimp flavor. Oh my gosh, and a little bit of green onion. I love this. So do we both rate it 10 out of 10? I think so, actually. I'm surprised. I wasn't, I thought I was going to like it, but I didn't think I was going to like it as much as I do. And this is a 10 out of a 10 for sure. And FYI, you can get garlic noodles there as well, and that's a vegetarian option. We've had them and they're pretty good. Not our favorite, but if you are looking for noodles and a vegetarian option, then that's a good choice. 
And Dad got over at Paradise Gardens a bigger portion of this because he's pretty hungry. Yeah, I get the bigger portion, right? Wow, that has like some baby corn in it and a couple different things. That looks really good. And it looks like it has more spice in it than ours, so we might have to try it, but yeah. why don't you try it first? It's very spicy, definitely. It is? Good. What do you give it? What do I give it? I give it a nine at, at, a nine? at least, yeah, it's good. Oh. Need a little soy sauce on it? Oh, sure, we like soy sauce. That would be a good option, but. But um, it's really good. So are you gonna try Dad's? I'm gonna try Dad's. I love spice. We are the girls who spice. So let's see. Let's compare the two, yeah. Very spicy, very good. So which do you like more? I like them both because with that one, um, you can get all the flavors. This, you're just eating spice and it's oh, really good. I love it. So it's I like know. a dream then. Right. So I probably would like a little more spice. Oh, nice. Yeah. But if you don't want spice, then you'll want the other option. Correct. Okay, I'm excited to try this dragon cocktail. This looks really good. The presentation is really pretty for sure. And it might pair really good with these noodles. So let's see. <laughs> Oh, that's really nice. Definitely tasty. I don't taste a lot of rum in it, but it's a nice flavor, kind of like a fruity flavor. Maybe give it a little stir. Always a good idea. And all the flavor is really nice. I'm gonna give it about a, like about an eight out of a 10. It's pretty good. It's definitely very refreshing with these noodles right here. <laughs> So I'm glad I got to try it because like I said, you're the dragon, right? It is. How much was it? I think it was like $17. Okay. So for the price, I don't know if I'll get it again, but I'm really glad that I tried it. And it's really tasty. If you like a kind of fruity drink with rum, then you might want to try this too. So my mom is going to try the dragon cocktail and let us know what she thinks. Here I go. I really like that. It's not strong. Um, I would say it's like a Starbucks strawberry acai. Oh yeah. I, I love it. Nice. What do you rate it? I would give it a 10 out of 10. Oh nice. So you really like it. Yeah, I really. It's definitely very refreshing. So uh, this is definitely a Joni Conway drink. Joni Conway. Wonderful. Stamp of approval. Stamp of approval, everybody. Did you hear that? <laughs> well, I guess now this drink might belong to you. <laughs> OK, next up we have the mandarin orange mousse cake. I believe we tried this last year and really loved it. It's beautiful, aesthetically pleasing, and also very tasty. And we found this over at Lucky Lantern, just so everybody knows. So. Uh, let's see if this is lucky, right? And I have three oh. spoons ready to go. Yes, you do. Ma, uh, Joni Conway is always ready for dessert. <laughs> okay, now I'm going to pull these out. It looks like little chocolate pieces. One for you and one for me. Look how pretty that is. Ooh, that's really pretty. That's the perfect cut. Isn't it? Let's see if it's as good as last year. Oh, that's really, I'm so glad we got it again. We were looking for a perfect dessert. You know, something I remember from last year, there's a little cookie at the bottom, so. Oh, there is. I forgot. Wonderful, what do you rate it? 15 out of 10. What? Yeah, it's good. Wow. You know, we start rating these things 15 and 30 out of 10, that that will mean that 10 out of 10 has no purpose purpose to it, you know? <laughs> you know, like 10 out of a 10 means it's just nothing out of the ordinary, but 30 out of a 10 means it's really good. Yes. Okay, well, it's always time for dessert time, especially if it's good quality dessert, so I'm excited to try this again. Got to get a piece of that cookie bite, of course. There we go. Happy Lunar New Year. <laughs> Very good. 
it's light and fluffy. If you like mousse cake and kind of like an orange mandarin flavor, oh, it's so good. And the presentation is beautiful. Yeah, I'm gonna give this about a 10 out of a 10. Not like a 20 out of a 10 like my mom gave it, <laughs> but like a 10 out of a 10, which is really good. 15 out of 10. Oh, we can do a 15 out of a 10, that's fine. No, I think that's what I said. Oh, okay, I got it. Well, then I'll do like a 12 out of a 10. How about that? <laughs> I'll take it. Really good. Okay, we're over by Lunar New Year Wishing Wall. It says 10 to 6 p.m. Can we still make a wish, Mom? Let's well, find out. <laughs> okay, I think from what I can gather, from 10 to 6 p.m., you can write a wish down right over here where normally there might be paper and pens, and you can hang it up right over here next to all of these other New Year wishes, which is amazing. My mom and I have done this the past couple years. We won't get the chance to do this today because it is past six, but- But we'll be back. We will be back, maybe even tomorrow, who knows? <laughs> but check this out, look at all of these wonderful New Year wishes. This is wonderful. And so pretty too. So tell us what your wish is gonna be, Mom. Well, I would do peace, love, and happiness. Okay, Miss America. <laughs> and good health. I think we're all voting for Joni Conway. <laughs> But those are all really good things to wish for, for sure. But so, some people have wished to be rich. To be rich, that's mine. Just kidding. <laughs> I'm kidding. And I'm kidding. then some people have wished to have a magic key for a lifetime. Who ever wished that or wrote it down as a genius? I know, <laughs> right? I wish I had that too. So for now, goodbye, but we'll be back. I think for now, my New Year's wish is to get another food item and maybe even another cheeky drink. What okay, do you think? Okay, let's do it. That's a wish we can make happen. Yeah. <laughs> okay, as you can see, we got more lovely food items to try for the evening, right? We have a complete buffet. So we got the red spice fried chicken bites. As you can see, these look really delicious. I think they had this last year, right, they Mom? They had it last year. It was one of my favorites. I had to have it again. Of course, and so we got it again, and this was at Red Dragon Spice Traders, I believe. You can get this fine item, so why don't you give that a try, Mom? Great. Okay, let's see if it compares to last year's. Looks really good. It does. Mm hmm Yeah? That's good. If you like spice, and I do. Of course, well, we love spice, you know that. Is it like very spicy? Mm-hmm. Ooh. Okay, I think I need to try this. All right, give it a try. Yeah. I think for us that's definitely a 10 out of a 10 because the chicken is really, really good. It's nice and fresh and it's very spicy, very hot. It's just exactly what I wanted. I'm really glad we got this again. Really good. Just as good as last year. So we highly recommend this. It might be a little bit tough if you don't like spicy things like us, but if you do, definitely try this. Okay, also from the Red Dragon Spice Traders, we have spicy fried rice with tofu and peas, I think. Looks really good, like dried peas. Do you know what? I tried a pea and I went, oh, I like that. Oh, it's good? Okay, I was wondering, I was like, is that gonna be good? But I don't know, why don't you try a full bite and tell us what you think? Okay. Mm. I think um, the sauce is unexpected, okay. but it's very, very good. I like it. I, another bite. Mm. And this is tofu, I believe, which I like. So then what do you rate this fried rice? I'm gonna give it a nine out of 10. Okay. Yeah, nine I like it. Wonderful, well, I can't wait to try. Okay, I'm gonna get a good bite, a little bit of those peas and the tofu, and what some of this sauce that my mom was talking about. Hmm. Interesting. Let me give it one more bite. <laughs> that, that's the true test. It is the true test. One more bite. Hmm. You know, I'm gonna give this 
a pretty solid eight and a half out of ten. Because it's really see. good. Mm -hmm. I like right. the noodles just a little bit more. But this is definitely a little spicy, which I love, and I'm definitely going to enjoy this. I think it'd be better with maybe a touch of soy sauce if you like that. And the tofu is delicious, and same with the peas. It's still really, really good. I just think I like the noodles a little bit more, but this is absolutely a good choice for sure. I mean, you've got to have a little bit of fried rice, right? Really important. I love fried rice. Totally. Okay, next up, we kind of cut it up a little bit, but at Prosperity Bao and Buns, we got this Kung Pao Bao. I love Kung Pao, chicken, shrimp, just about anything. So I have a feeling I'm going to like it in a bao just as much, but let's give it a go. All right, got a nice bite here. Exciting, see, look at that. Look at that, delicious. Okay, here we go. Where do you rate it? Let me think. You know, that's pretty good. That's really good. Like I said, I love Kung Pao just about anything. I don't know why, but I was kind of hoping it'd be a little bit spicy, but not everybody might hope that it's spicy, you know? But I'm gonna give it like a nine and a half out of 10. I wish I had a spicy kick to it, but that's just me. Maybe it shouldn't. What do you think, mom? <laughs> we'll see. Why don't I'm we see? next. Okay, mom's going in for the Kung Pao Bao. <laughs> I am. Let's see. I do like Kung Pao chicken, so. Oh yeah, Kung Pao anything is a good idea. Mm. I'm gonna call this very good eight out of 10. Eight out of a 10? How so? Well, it's actually, um, Bao's are not, Bao buns, are not my favorite. Oh, okay, got it. So anyone else would probably just die for it. Um, uh, I think the meat is good. Uh, everything, the seasoning is very good. Uh -huh. Yeah, I call it an eight out of 10. You know what I'm thinking, I, which is why I don't like it as much as I thought? And this is like a whole different thing to buy, but if you actually go to Disneyland at the, is it the Tropical Hideaway? Oh, Tropical Hideaway. And they have buns and they have these veggie buns with like a They're spice. so good. Yeah, there's a spicy dipping sauce that you can like dip them in mm -hmm. and like, those are like fire. They're like really, really good. So I think I just like those a little bit better for some reason. I'm gonna agree with you. Yeah. Yeah, this just didn't meet my expectations. Yeah. But I definitely, one of these days, want to head back to Tropical Hideaway. It's oh, been, great idea. It's been a while since we've been there, actually. It is. <laughs> okay, next up at Bamboo Blessings, we have the Vietnamese-style iced coffee. And it's purple. It even looked, uh, I got one too, as you can see. It looked prettier, like, you know, 15 minutes ago. Because there was, like, this beautiful purple, like, swirl. Swirl on the top of it. Then, like, check it out, though. It's kind of, like, melting into the coffee like this pretty purple swirl color. And it's iced coffee, so obviously we had to both try it. Yes. Yeah, as Let's you can see, see, I have such confidence in this drink that I ordered one of my own, so. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I didn't have high expectations for this. This is really good. The coffee taste is amazing in it. Uh, I don't know this, what the swirl is. What is it, Linz? It was... I'm not sure. Uh, taro, taro. It's taro. Okay. And, um, you know, just the whole mixture. It's just got a great coffee flavor. I love this. Good. Would you get it again? Cheers. Yes. Oh, wonderful. What, what do you rate it? I uh, 10 out of 10. Ooh. I like this. Okay, here we go. It's always time for coffee magic, right? Uh, well, now's a good time. Oh yeah, and pretty coffee magic too, because it's purple. Mm. That's good. And it is like a little sweet, it's not overly sweet. I mean, you can taste the coffee in it. So it's a good balance. I like to taste a little bit of coffee in my iced coffee. Well, obviously. It's really good, but it's not just like overpoweringly sweet, if you know what I mean. I agree. Mm -hmm. That's why it, you could taste mm -hmm. the coffee. It I just like had a great flavor. Yeah, this is a 10 out of a 10. I actually like this more than the Dragon Cocktail. Really good. I'm going to agree with you. Yeah. 
Okay, mom, coffee cheers. Coffee cheers. Happy Lunar New Year. <laughs> Well, everybody, we had a great day at Lunar New Year 2024, Year of the Dragon. So much fun. We got, we did a lot today, we actually. We did a lot. The only thing we missed was the wish. The wish. We will wish it in our hearts for now, right? That's correct. Then we'll come back and make a wish or two. Or two. And we'll definitely go and see Mei Mei again. Mei and Mei. Mainly, for sure. And also you can see Raya over on the trail as well. We might do that next time. Of course, and more character friends, and there's more food to eat, there's more to see, more cheeky drinks. But unfortunately, we are all cheekied out for the night, I think. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and it's getting a little cold, plus our cat Tippy awaits. It's cold. <laughs> yes, Tippy awaits, it's a little cold, so I think that means it is the end of our video, but only for now. Because we have tons of videos coming out really soon at theme parks, at travel locations, at filming locations, at Disney, who knows where you will see us next. So if you liked our video, do consider hitting that like and subscribe button because it does help our channel out a whole lot. Plus, it'll keep you guys updated on our Disney adventures. Okay, Mom, what was your favorite moment of the day and your favorite top food items and drink items? Okay, meeting May May and, and Ming. Ming. Yeah, <laughs> that was my favorite thing that we did. I, I they were so generous with their time. Mm -hmm. I love them. I know they were they were wonderful. Another mother daughter duo. <laughs> the most. More epic than us, actually. Way more epic. <laughs> Way more cool. <laughs> Way yeah. more cool, too. <laughs> but we en enjoyed uh, talking with them. Definitely. And the parade was just fire today. It was wonderful. Um, now, what about your favorite food items? Okay, my favorite. This will surprise you. Okay. That coffee. That was your top choice? <laughs> that was my top choice. <laughs> it was actually mine too, I think. <laughs> it was at the top of the list. Yeah. I did also like um, the spicy noodles. Did you like the spicy over the other ones? Yes. Okay. For me. For me. So we liked the spicy ones over at the Paradise Grill, right? Mm -hmm. Correct. Yeah. Those are really good. That's a good choice. And as you can see, the portion was really big, big. as well. Big. Yeah. It was $17. <laughs> something to consider. Yeah, it was 17 but you can split it with someone. Hey, that drink I bought was $17, the <laughs> right. dragon cocktail. Good so point. It's really not that much if you think no. about it. No. <laughs> the other thing we liked was the spicy chicken. I loved mm -hmm. from last year, too. Yes. Spicy chicken all the way. Yes. Loved it. That, the coffee, and the noodles, I think, definitely get the, mm -hmm. the stamp of approval. <laughs> you know, I'm thinking next time, the coffee and the spicy chicken, I'm good. Ooh, yeah. yeah. Definitely meet our friends again and see the parade. Yeah. Sounds like a good day to me. Yep. <laughs> and we'll definitely make a wish the next time we're here. But till then, stay safe out there, stay awesome, and perhaps sometime we will see you at Lunar New Year at Disney California Adventure. Have a great day, everybody, and thank you so much for watching. Bye! Bye.